What's up, haters? Welcome back. We've got another Jubilee video for you today. This is a good one. I can tell. Just by reading the title of this video, six vegans versus one meat eater. I'm gonna try and be as unbiased as possible while watching this video, but I have to say, there's a ton of stereotypes with veganism. I'm not against it at all. I actually considered it myself. No, I haven't. They do a lot of quirky shit. I'm sure this episode is chock full of all those stereotypes, so I'm here to make fun of them. Let's watch it. Hey, pooch. Hey, pooch. Cool. My dog fucking hates me. All right, let's watch this. What's your favorite candy? Most candies without gelatin in it. Name one. Nerd Sour Patch Kids. Name one. Sour Patch Kids. Okay, those aren't vegan. Okay, my bad. Shit. We brought together seven vegans. I am vegan. I am vegan. I'm a vegan. I am vegan. I am a vegan. I am a vegan. I am vegan. One is a liar. If the group discovers who the liar is, they'll split a cash prize. How do we know that they're not vegan and also a liar? Just saying. If the liar survives, he or she wins the entire prize. Let's do it. Okay, Brandon, yes. what do you eat for breakfast? This morning I had buckwheat, buckwheat hot cereal, add almond milk and some water. Okay. Who eats buckwheat in the morning? Like I All right, so uh, who eats buckwheat in the morning? I don't know. Who the f decided that you are the annihilator of all these people? I mean, who Sus. No, people do, but I'm looking at him and his body language and how he's telling me and I'm going, you just had Buckwheat? Definitely vegan. I eat buckwheat every single day for breakfast, and I feel like that's a normal thing. Love how they also, like, gave you the notes. They're like, also, Jubilee intern, she's going in hot on him, so we figured, just to make this more interesting, we'll just let you know he's a fucking intern here. Everyone acted like it was a weird thing. Um, I'll be honest, I eat everything on bread. I have to. Because, like, I just, I'm a recent vegan. I've been vegan for, like, five months. It's a challenge I did for myself. I have a question. What are y'all's favorite restaurants? Did you guys check out in North Hollywood? Sus, dude. You're talking a lot. Now that I think about it, that's kind of a stereotype. Okay, whatever. But we'll go back. Is this like awesome? It's really like, it's Cajun vegan. Oh yes, oh yes. You know, um, dude. I literally been taking. Oh gosh, I talk. I took it? my friend Hannah. Uh, She's uh, actually uh, a big uh, YouTuber something. as well. Everything that came out of his mouth was super random. Brandon, what's your favorite like, restaurant? How the fuck was that random? They just look at a moment. What a random? It was fate? I bet she's single. I go to Taco Bell all the time. What do you get at Taco Bell? I get a crunch wrap, but swap out the beef and get some beans in there. Same. Also swap out the sour cream and the cheese. And yeah. Don't they use eggs beans. in their like in their wraps? I hope they don't. Yeah, but I hope they don't either I, because then that wouldn't be vegan. I don't know why she's coming. I hope that they don't either because that wouldn't be vegan. But you fucking know that they fucking do, and you're just dogging this dude. Ugh, this is gonna be a terrible episode for me. I'm gonna be in and out of every comment. Okay, let's continue. I don't know if it's like the way I look. I don't look like a vegan. Um, why is everyone here a vegan? I'm vegan because I actually moved out here. I felt like I was like, all right. He's vegan because he moved out here. I mess up, I can keep on doing it. So I challenged myself on five months in, and I was like, all right, I'm gonna continue doing it. Because if you I You guys, we have four minutes left, sorry to interrupt you, but we have four minutes, sorry. I wanna sorry. hear from oh, other sorry. people, sorry. I wanna know. Is, what is she, the fucking executive producer? Of veganism? Of the show? I, I can't tell, because it feels like, I feel like she's running my life. I did it can you, because I wanted to can, can you, can you, just, we got, sorry, we got it? Sorry, you, let's go. Okay, so she's directing now. She's a fucking director. I swear to shit, man. I, I'm trying to not follow the stereotypes shit, but I, I, I'm falling into the trap. So Jubilee, congrats to you. You've done what you've needed to do. Whereas Jalen was just taking up all the time so that I couldn't find any information about anything. Environment. I think the meat and dairy industry just contributes way too much to our environmental issues, and so that's why I decided to go vegan. I've been Legit. vegan for almost three years. I kind of just followed like blogs and stuff, and then I found out I had like high cholesterol. I like cold turkey, just like quit it. The more I learned about Dude, it, Dude, did you just see her? She is so. So I understand that this whole thing is is me being judgmental about people, but holy. F she should run this fucking YouTube because you can just tell by her demeanor she's judging the shit out of everybody. I swear to f they're paying her to be the director on this fucking show. Educated myself the more I wanted to keep going. I initially went vegan for my health, for my skin. It's kind of helped. It hasn't helped that much, but I think just when I was doing it, I was like, why go back? Kind of like you, like 
I could do it. And I don't think there was a huge like pressing environmental factor, which is like, I can do it right now. Okay, so no, why exactly nice. go back? And it's like been good. So it's almost been like a year. So kind of similar to you. Good, good job, yeah. man. I uh, became vegan for um, animal cruelty reasons. It's a whole Good reason. bunch of stuff you know you can go into, but yeah, for animal reasons and environmental reasons and health reasons. So I've been vegan for almost 10 years combined. Um, started off when I was 21 years old. I was drinking heavily and I just wanted to be feeling like better in my body. So I took a yoga class, went vegan overnight, went raw vegan for two years, uh, became a raw food chef. I'm a yoga teacher now. Um, yeah. I went vegan kind of as like a transition. All right. I I'll give her some credit. Ten years. Um, Be a total <laughs> the whole time. Um, I so. want to. We ask. Oh, no, I don't want to cut you off. Yeah, but I want to ask specific sorry. questions to people. But. Jesus, f <laughs> dude. What? Jesus, just let the fucking guy talk. Are you a paid fucking actor? I mean, we've all this, we all, we've all assumed that you're 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 not an imposter. So I mean, we all know that. But Jesus, just let the fucking guy do it. We all did the whole rounds, and you're gonna cut him off so you can ask questions. Like you're the oh my, I swear to shit. What is your favorite documentary oh. that helped you go with the? Oh, help me go vegan. I kind of watched like those YouTube ones. Which ones? Like what? What name one? I don't remember the name. Oh my. Now she's just grilling people. Holy shit. I like saw them in the blogs that I was talking about and like which blog? Um Elia, you're gonna love this episode, buddy. <laughs> it was called it was like this girl, her name is Emma. I gave her the sign, I like, hmm, you don't know what blog, you don't know what post, you don't know this, you don't know you don't know anything. Okay, so that's a legit question that she asked, but I I'm I'm shrouded. I'm clouded. The privilege. It's like it's like the privilege is just crazy with this one. Yeah. Um Ooh. cows getting oh. butchered. Uh, From you geez. can see them getting cut up. Yeah, it sucks. Red cool. light. So like that oh. was really traumatizing. Yeah, it sucks. <laughs> She had a little more makeup on and she had nail polish on and so I guess in my head I think vegans just go for the more natural sort of look. Legit. I was like looking for some cues and like what people were wearing and he was wearing like suede shoes. Most like vegans don't really wear leather. I feel bad. I feel like he's just trying to be a vegan and they're like dogging his ass. Okay. <laughs> Bye guys. Oh. Bye. Nice to know you guys. See ya. <laughs> I was really shocked. I think I was a little bit shocked. I'm not even trying to find the fucking, I, at this point, I, I assumed I was like gonna look if I myself could find who the, the actual vegan was, but I, I'm, I'm just, I'm pissed at this chick. Queen of the vegans, you know? You know, I was considering, I am still am, but this is, it's pissing me off, I don't want, okay, all right. And like, I forgot the names of everything, and I was like, there's cameras here, and like, everyone's watching yeah, me, that's and like, normal. the time is ticking. And what is your favorite soap that you use? Oh my gosh. I'm more vegan for like, food related reasons. Put her on the fucking payroll. She's a producer at this point. Right, so. but typically like, if you're vegan, yeah, then you know, know you use all your products that you love. I identify as vegan, but I do it more so for food related reasons, not exactly, because I like did it for my health. Uh, sure. Free with you, yeah. Do you wear leather? Are you sure? Uh, I don't own leather. It's interesting. I own leather, but I don't buy leather. It's leather that has been bought years ago that I still have that I feel is kind of like wasteful to like throw away. The important thing is you don't buy yeah. leather because we vote with our dollars. Exactly. I think like in this circle, like there would still be people who like identify themselves as vegan, even if it's like food related or like something else. Like the rain, just like but There's ethical. like levels, yeah. Yeah, but I think like the My on right now wouldn't be someone who like, green girl. is like me, like just doing it for food. You guys, yeah, you guys ask me questions too. I like questions. Oh, do you like questions, Jalen? Do you like questions? Here's my question. Why the f are you wearing a suit? That's f weird, bro. Cause we're all just wearing t-shirts and shit. You capitalist pig. Answer that. Questions. Do you eat honey? <laughs> Do you eat honey? I actually don't I even, like, I don't eat honey. True. Yeah, I, I don't, I just don't at all. I eat honey, but. Honey isn't vegan. <laughs> it's not <laughs> vegan. It's not. Cause the bees make it, just son of a. I did, he didn't mention that. He said that he got the taco and then he removed everything. And then yeah. he mentioned that later on. I have seen vegan YouTubers who like go to Taco, taco Bell like and like can make it vegan, vegan just to show yeah. people that like it can be like That's convenient. Yeah, because vegans also like Taco Bell and they're doing their <laughs> best 
to be vegan, and that's cool. Veganism is cool. But being like a fucking about it, where you're like screaming at me, that's not fucking vegan. It's like not cool. If you're vegan and you're trying your damnedest to be vegan, and you don't want to hurt animals, that's dope. And if you fuck up a little bit, just fix it. Do better. But it's okay. But these people, where they're like screaming at you, and they're like, you're not fucking vegan. I mean, you're ruining it. Like, they're they're trying. Let's just keep watching. I don't know why you guys are <laughs> oh, just, trying to yeah, tell yeah. me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, whoa. No, no, we have two minutes and left. Del yeah. Taco also has Del Taco, Del Taco the Beyond. Has the Beyond Meat. Why don't you go there if you're vegan? Oh, I thought well, I don't know. was pretty aggressive. We didn't know. But, in all the but now we know. The best ways for a game like this, like, she asks all the, like, heavy-hitting questions, which is exactly um, how it should have been. Anybody What's your favorite? You're fucking fake, dude. That's exactly what the producer of the show that we hired this lady in the green shirt to do. Paid actors. Candy. Favorite candy. Most candies without gelatin in it. Nerds. Name one. Name one. Name one. Name a fucking candy without gelatin. You can't. Nerd, sour patch kids. Just, just name. You named three already, but I'm telling you to name more. Name one. More. Name more. <laughs> name him. Name 17. Okay, those aren't yeah. vegan. It's not a good vegan, bitch. You're so stupid. <laughs> do they not have, do they have gelatin in them? I, okay. Maybe I'm not a vegan. I don't, <laughs> like, I don't, I don't. This is like the most genuine guy in the show. I know he's vegan. He's just trying his best and they're just wrecking him. I, he's gonna go and get a slab of ribs after this shit. They were. But I mean, you know. What's your favorite candy? I don't eat candy. Of course she doesn't because everything is not vegan because it's all shit. It's all garbage. Yeah, I don't. I'm surprised that guy's even still here. It didn't seem that his ethics and his values were in alignment with the diet because typically when you are vegan, everything surrounding you matches that. Maybe people are just trying to get into it and they're like trying to, they're trying to become it. I understand that. Cut a little bit here, you cut a little bit there. Nobody just, you know, engulfs their whole life into it. This is why we have these arguments between people one or zero, binary. You know, it's like stupid. I'm surprised he lasted this long. They hated him. I'm not like or she really did. a part of the vegan community, I feel like. <laughs> I have one vegan friend. I could have had five vegan friends, but they voted me out, so. Dude, I feel fucking bad for this guy. Like a genuine guy. I honestly think he is vegan. I think he just did, he, he was learning. Everyone feels <laughs> confident that you already caught the ball and the game now. The mole, the green girl, mole. That she's fucking steak every weekend. I fucking, I'm calling it. He's already confiding in her because he's so confident she's not the mole. Yeah. Wait, so we raise our hand if we think he's still in here. I'm, I'm, fucking, I'm calling the odds. It's her. She just spent the whole weekend Googling what this vegan stereotypes and just playing it off. This bitch loves a fucking rack of ribs. I'm telling you. Yeah. I think they might. I don't know. <laughs> but no, I think no. Raise your hand if you think the mole is still in the square. If the lights they got him. They got him. It was that guy. Because that dude eats fucking Sour Patch Kids. That was... <laughs> you voted the liar out. If the lights turn red, the liar's still in the box. That dude's smiling. Pretty okay, creepy. That's so sus. A little bit more secureness. That's sus. He's smiling pretty hard. Oh, shit. Dang, oh, oh, found the most. <laughs> He dressed as a capitalist pig. Pig. Meat. You fucked up. Failure. No! I, know. I, know. I, know. I, know. I feel like I'm I failing. Talking too much. He was obnoxious. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna end the stream. Oh, you guys are the best. Oh, yeah. Thank you. 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 First round, getting thrown in, I was tested to see if I was gonna trip up on my work. I don't know 
I'm just judgmental, but I could just see that that guy right there just cutting a piece of steak and enjoying it. That's all I'm saying. It's how much knowledge I actually have. So I'm like, if I go first, I can speak the most and make it seem like an accident. So I just want time to run out. So it felt good because people got annoyed. And they Must have been the tie. So they pushed me aside and started talking to everybody else. I got one from my fam. I got one from my fam. I got one from me, one from my new Xbox. All right. I'm pretty frustrated because I think I could have won if I hadn't just been affected by everybody else's doubtfulness. I was um, reminded of the kind of a life lesson. Of veganism. I don't think you can really like see a vegan. It's more like their thoughts and like their ideology and how they think about the world. Thanks for watching. We love making this stuff for you. Um, I love watching this stuff, so keep making it. You guys are awesome. Thank you for watching this video. I screamed more than I usually do at the microphone. It's why we paid for it and why I got this little spit screen. Oh, it's for the wind, not the spit. Well, it works both ways. Anyway, thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, join my Discord in the description. See you at the next video. See you later. Peace.